everyone today we get to play on the infernal shrines looks like we're the fourth pick so we get to kind of fill in for our team but more or less counter the other team uh looks like the friendly team is going to have the first ban which also means we get the first pick so we'll see how well we go uh infernal shrines i think it's normally one of my worst maps but we'll try to uh avoid that and get a victory today uh, once again, we are still doing our placement matches. We are three wins, one loss right now. And I think the last game we were playing with gold three. So I'm assuming we're going to be around uh, gold three again. Uh, that's the case. Then I do believe I am going to be outmatched here. I really do see myself as a gold five person right now. But who knows? We shall see. Uh, looks like our team captain is silver kisses. So they get to, they have the highest MMR and they get to be our first pick. So let's hope that they can get a good anchor of a first pick. Um, Dahaka is good. Uh, Sylvanas is definitely good on this map. And look, look there it is. And uh, Silver Kiss has now picked up Sylvanas. So if we get any kind of uh, Punisher, we will be able to get a very good push with it. Uh... T two O tall and arc now get to counter it. So any kind of dive or or silence will be able to uh, do a lot of damage against her. Uh, Kalthos very good on this map. Um, let's see what else they pick up. Uh, any kind of uh, okay, they're gone with two mages. So any kind of spell armor here or spell mitigation uh, or dive will be definitely be able to uh, do a, a lot for us. Um, yeah, I think the uh, I think the Genji is going to be able to do wonders against them. Uh, looks like we are going to be in the. Um, looks like we are going to be. Uh, tank roll. Looks like we've been in the tank roll a lot lately. Alright, so we could be Stitches and get Dampen Magic at 1. We could be Tyriel, who has a baseline uh, 15 spell armor, or we can be a Nubrak. All these have spell armor. Um... Anubarak is one of my favorite ones. Um, like Anubarak, I feel a lot more comfortable. Like so, Anubarak stitches um, are my two favorite. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Yeah, all right. So far as far as peel goes, I will go with the noob. Um cuz Anubarak does have really good peel. Um he can do some substantial uh, substantial damage. Um uh, Um and I'll also be able to uh um, I think I'll cocoon probably Uther. Yep. So, with what we have right now, I think it's actually pretty good. So, a Nubrak, uh, good CC and has spell armor, and I can get a spell shield at level 1 to help against their two main damage dealers. Uh, I can cocoon their healer or whomever, let's say they pick up Malthael. Uh, I can cocoon Malthael. Um, we have Sylvanas that can push with the, uh, with the immortal uh, Greymane. 
Yep, if he goes twin blaze, we might as well just get rid of him. Uh, Genji can go on the back line. Lucio heal us up, so um, he doesn't have targeted healing. That's the only difference. The two uh, the two mages here really does make it uh, interesting. Two mages, two heavy frontliners, and a frontline uh, support. We'll see what uh, um, what Varian picks up because if he goes with like if he goes like Twin Blades or Colossal Smash, then I will get wrecked. But um, if we can cocoon him before he goes in, then uh, we'll be able to get a five v four and go from there. Um, so we are just going to go with Nerubian Armor. Uh, Gain the spell shield. So I do have a uh, base armor, a uh, base spell armor of 20, and then with the uh, Nerubian shield, also gives me a uh, 30. Um, so let's let's see what we can do. Uh. I think as far as all right well let's just make sure we try not to get caught in that we'll just throw that up the spell shield is working out really well for us there we go. Uh, looks like oh, we missed that one. We can zone him off. There we go. Just make sure that. So with the new lane changes, if we can uh, bully them out. Uh, we are able to get um, some decent. Oh, could we actually get a pick here? There we go. So uh, we, if we can bully them out, we can actually uh, get higher sustain because we can just take their um, uh, their regen gloves. So it's actually uh, pretty important that we do uh, like just try to bully them out a little bit. It looks like the. The Lucio was kind of AFK there for half a second. Uh, let's see, we are going to go better barbs here. Uh, let's just have a quick look. Looks like he is going with a um, Twin Blades build. Uh, we are all coming down into the bottom. Uh, let's just back it up. There we go. Grab that last last little bit of XP. It's level five to level five. So I'm just gonna wait here. There we go. We were able to get the three. There we go. There, got, got that quick pick. Um, let's just see if we can't. Uh, the Lucio's 
bringing us up a little bit. Grab the regen globe. There we are. Uh, sucks that the um, we do have thirty six of what we need. Uh, we were able to grab that, so that's excellent for us. They are... Uh, oh, sweet. Looks like we were able to grab one more kill. Uh, we are going to go with a uh, subterranean shield. There we go. Able to cap or get a kill there on the Muradin. Uh, he just overextended a little bit. So, uh, looks like we are just gonna give this up. We pushed really well with it. Um, let's just go ahead and try to take this and then I got to back away because I will be out of mana. Um, we were able to actually grab two there. Uh, I did say that I was going to uh, back away as soon as I got that, but I'm going to do that now. Just to get full health, full mana. We do have a three level lead right now. Um, with that, uh, with that push, once again, we do have the Savannahs, which we're actually able to push with keep using the first. Um, using the first uh, Punisher, which normally gets gets a fort and that's about it. Uh, looks like Grey Main's just gonna go and uh, get full health mana here. Let's just make sure that we are attacking I just want to make sure that we are eliminating the enemy team. Uh, looks like there is a fight up top, or at the bottom here. So I'm just going to come in and try to help out. Uh, we were able to get the one kill. Uh, let's see if we can't... There we go. We're able to grab the one. Uh, with Sylvanas, we should be able to get uh, this keep. We don't want to group up too much here. There we go. Now we can just back away. And we, uh, we do know exactly where the next uh, the next shrine is. So we can go ahead and grab that for the friendly team. Uh, it's level 12 to level 10. So if we can get... Uh, I think maybe with this wave, yep, we will have level 13. Um, they should probably just give this up and soak. Uh, 
Uh, we're going to go with Acid Drenched Manibles here. Give us a little bit more damage. Let's just go ahead and... There we go. Alright, well he looks like he's coming after me. And the Lucio was able to keep me alive. And it looks like we did uh, get the Kael'thas, or the both KTs, there on the end. Uh, just trying to see here. I think we're actually doing pretty well. Uh, we will be able to get a lot of value out of this. Punisher as well, especially since there's uh, several uh, and members of the enemy team dead. Um, let's just think the the variant didn't even show up for that fight. Uh. Okay, we should be able to push in. There we go. Okay, well, I think we should be able to... There we are. And we are fine. I'm just going to get ready to... Looks like we are just going to be content with taking this and then probably just backing away. And we'll go ahead and clean up all the mercenary camps. Uh, we are going to go with uh, Epicenter here. There we go. Once again, we should be able to clean this up very easily. Uh, we do have all the uh, camps pushing. Uh, that was kind of a wasted ult there. Uh, sh I'm just yeah. We're all just gonna come over here and grab this. Okay. Uh, looks like we are. Oh no, no, Genji's coming back. Okay. Yeah. Alright, well, if they're going to be caught out, we might as well go ahead and take it. Uh, looks like... Okay. Let's see here. We'll go ahead and root him up. Their only dive is, uh, Go ahead and back away. The Sylvanas is doing work. Um, not sure if we can actually end here. Alright, let's just go ahead. Power to the 
All right. We were able to get a little bit more damage out. Oh, dang. There we go. Uh, let's go ahead and heal up. There we go. All right. We do have one kill each. We have uh, pressure in all the lanes. Our Sylvanas is going to be up sooner. We have level 15 to level 18. Uh, let's just go ahead and keep this going. Not sure what they're doing. We do see uh, KT at the um, at the base. Uh, there's still there's still actually um, all of them alive. I only see I only see the one, so I'm assuming that they've given up, which is kind of disappointing. Let's see. Um, we do see Murd in there. All right. Well, he's dead. Uh, let's see here. And that's GG. All right. Well, that was pretty easy. Victory. Uh, we had pressure in all lanes. We had uh, the Punisher, the Sylvanas got value. This Grayman did really well. Dived in. I had very little CC. I had very little to do with that, but it looks like I was able to soak 34% of the team's damage. Um. Yeah, I think that just went really well. Uh, Kael'thas was able to get his uh, stacks pretty early there, but uh, he wasn't quite able to capitalize on it. It looks like we got the Arctic Reindeer Mount. Perfect. Uh, so that does make our record um, f uh, four wins, one loss. Uh, let's look at the stats for today. We had no kills, 14 assists, no deaths. We did 33,616 siege damage, 13,004 in hero damage. Uh, total damage taken of 42,682 for a total XP contribution of 9,198. Uh, looks like the Lucio did 61,000 in healing. Um, the Genji did 40,000 in uh, hero damage. And the Greyman did 37,000. Um... They were both able to get on the back line really easily. Uh, we were able to capitalize since the Varian did, uh, I think he went Colossus Smash. Since he did go Colossus Smash, we were able to, uh, no, he went Twin Blade, sorry. We were able to capitalize, especially in the early game before he got level 10, because that's when he really kind of comes online. We were able to capitalize, and we, we did really well. Uh, but let me know what you guys think and what we could have done a little bit better, and have a great day.